As stipulated by the Public Financial Act, the budget statement was scheduled to be read on November 15, at least one clear month before the end of the financial year, as stipulated in Article 179 of the Constitution. Well, this has, however, been delayed due to ongoing discussions between the government of Ghana and the International Monetary Fund. Well, Cabinet will first have to approve it before it is sent to the IMF for perusal and possible suggestions. Majority leader Oseche Mensah-Bonso recently hinted that the budget reading had been rescheduled to November 24 to allow for more time. The budget is highly anticipated because of Ghana's current economic crisis and negotiations with the International Monetary Fund for support. However, the latest dismissal of Charles Edubuahin, the Minister of State at the Finance Ministry, could muddy the waters, seeing that Charles Edubuahin, according to inside sources, was the brain and soul of the ministry. He oversaw budget and finance and was particularly key and involved in all the negotiations with the International Monetary Fund. As a member of the Bank of Ghana board, he was the go-to person. Many have wondered what will become of Keno Foriata with the exit of Charles Edubuahin. The finance minister was hoping that a staff level agreement will be reached with the Bretton Woods institution and details expected to form the basis of the 2023 budget. The government will have to fast track preparations for the 2023 budget reading and ensure it delivers it by the 24th deadline to avoid a possible breach of the law.